The world is less than a week from seeing a solar solar eclipse here in Southern California, though. We will see a partial eclipse. Yeah, and this week's One on Earth, KCAL meteorologist Marina Jurica explains what to expect when we look up in the sky. On Monday, we'll experience a partial solar eclipse. The line of totality won't pass through California, but it's still worth watching as the moon partially blocks out the sun, creating a unique spectacle. The event will begin in Southern California around 10 a.m. and peak at 11:12 a.m., where over half of the sun will be blocked. Here is a chart of the 115 mile path of totality. The eclipse will travel a narrow path of 13 states from Texas all the way up to Maine. The whole event will take about two and a half hours, but totality will only last about four minutes in each location. Now, it's essential to wear protective eyewear during a solar eclipse because looking directly at the sun, even during a partial eclipse, can cause serious eye damage. The intense solar radiation can harm your eyes without you even feeling it as the sun's visible and invisible rays can damage the cells in your retina. So make sure to use certified solar viewing glasses to safely enjoy the eclipse. Now, how does this phenomenon occur? Well, during a solar eclipse, the moon passes between the sun and the earth, casting a shadow on our planet. And this happens because the moon's orbit intersects with the earth's orbit around the sun, aligning them just perfectly. Now, here's a cool part. Did you know that solar eclipses can only happen during a new moon? phase. That's when the moon is positioned directly between the earth and the sun blocking the sunlight. During a total solar eclipse, the moon completely covers the sun, revealing the outer atmosphere, the corona, which is usually hidden by the sun's glare. And we're just going to see it here in a moment. There it goes. And also, solar eclipses have been crucial in scientific discoveries. For instance, in 1919, during a total Total solar eclipse. Astronomers confirmed Einstein's theory of general relativity by observing the bending of starlight near the sun. Well, be sure to check local eclipse times and duration charts for precise information for your exact area. Grab those glasses and enjoy. California will be in the path of totality in 2045. Something to look forward to. And that's what on earth for this week.